My name is uh, Andrei Sazikin. I am from Ural Federal University, uh, Russia. And uh, first of all, I would like uh, to thank you for inviting me uh, today. It's a great honor for me. Uh, first, I will uh, briefly describe uh, our university. It is uh, situated in Yekaterinburg, Russia, which is one of the uh, largest universities in Russia. It has uh, 30,000 uh, 30, students, uh, 13 different institutes, and um, last year our university hosted the ACM Global Program in Championship Final. Uh, in uh, 2013, our Cisco Academy was named the best uh, Cisco Academy in Europe, and uh, our IT security team, Hacker Dome, uh, twice won the um, European competition uh, CTF in security. Uh, our university has a relatively small uh, cluster. It uh, consists of uh, 20, 12 uh, nodes uh, and includes uh, Xeon Phi and uh, NVIDIA GPU accelerators. Uh, we also uh, work uh, together with the Institute of uh, Mathematics and Mechanics uh, of Royal Branch of Russian Academy of Science, which is also situated in Ekaterinburg, and uh, we have access to the supercomputer run of uh, that institute. It uh, has the 240 teraflop, teraflops peak uh, performance, and uh, it's uh, mostly used uh, GPU for as a computational resource. I will speak about uh, head modeling on uh, parallel computing system. We participate in the project personalized, personalized computational modeling of a human head for biology and medicine. It's supported by Russian Science Foundation, and we have an interdisciplinary team, uh, Institute of Immunology and Physiology and Ghent University, Belgium, uh, developing the models of the head, uh, different uh, components of head model, and uh, our university and Institute of Mathematics and Mechanics uh, implemented this uh, model in, uh, for parallel computing. Uh, <coughs> Uh, people from the uh, Institute of Immunology and Physiology uh, developed several state-of-the-art uh, head models, uh, such as Ekaterinburg Oxford Electromechanical Cell Model and the model of uh, anatomy and fiber orientation field of the left ventricle of the head. And our task was to implement this uh, model uh, for parallel computing system. Uh, head consists of uh, four main chambers. It's two ventricle and through atrium. Uh, we do, uh, simulate only left ventricle because it's uh, the largest ventricle and it's uh, the most powerful and it's uh, pump the blood uh, to the almost all or body organs. Uh, the main function of the head is to pump blood through the body by contraction. Contraction is uh, triggered by electrical activation of myocardium. But uh, it's uh, not enough to simulate only electrical equation because uh, mechanical deformation influences the cardiac electrical activity with so-called mechanical electric feedback. So we should simulate firstly anatomical model. It's a form of a head mechanical model and electrophysiological model. Uh, we develop so-called uh, Levin system. Uh, it's called Levin uh, by two reasons. It's uh, acronym LV, left ventricle, and it's also to live in Dutch. Uh, we implemented uh, several models. Uh, for anatomical model, we implement theoretical model with uh, fiber orientation field developed at uh, our colleagues uh, from Institute of Immunology and Physiology. Uh, we implemented two mechanical models. It's a standard model by Hunter and uh, Guccione, and uh, we also implemented a uh, free electrophysiological model. It's uh, simple Aliyev Panfilov model, more uh, complicated than Tusker Nobel Nobel Panfilov, and uh, another uh, model, Ekaterinburg Oxford, also developed by our group. Uh, here is the architecture of uh, Levin system. It consists of grid generation, which uh, produces a grid for electrophysiological and mechanical grids. It's uh, in the form of uh, the hut, with, uh, which takes into account the orientation of the fiber in the hut. 
Uh, it also contains mechanical simulation and electrophysiological simulation. This uh, model is uh, working together. For one step of uh, mechanical simulation, we perform 100 steps of electrophysiological simulation. Also, we have uh, visualiza visualization of uh, results. Some uh, implementation details it's implemented in VC. We use uh, OpenMP for parallelization, ParaView for virtualization. Uh, for mechanical simulation, we use uh, mass print system methods, which uh, provide significant speed up compared to a finite element method uh, traditionally used for this purpose. And for electrophysiological simulation, we use uh, explicit Taylor method. Uh, we test uh, performance of uh, our system. We simulate one cardiac cycle, uh, cardiac cycle of one second physical time. Uh, we use simple Aliyev Panfilov electrophysiological model and uh, relatively simple Hartiv uh, mechanical model. Uh, it's work on one computer with this uh, characteristic. Uh, we achieve significant speed up, but scalability is uh, very limited. After five or six uh, uh, cores, speed up is uh, not increasing. Uh, our system was used for different uh, applications. One uh, example of uh, usage is uh, studying of uh, drift of scroll wave in left ventricle. Scroll waves uh, leads to cardiac arrhythmias. It's a uh, very common disease. And uh, we should understand the factors underlying dynamic of scroll wave to determine the type of cardiac arrhythmia. So, conclusion of our system, we simulate the left ventricle overhead on a parallel computing system. Uh, we use tightly coupled simulation of electrophysiological and mechanical. Uh, parallelization was made by OpenMP for shared memory system. Uh, we achieve six times sped up, but unfortunately, scalability is uh, very limited. In the future, we uh, first uh, step is to improve scalability. Uh, unfortunately, it uh, required to completely redesign the system uh, because it uh, was implemented by uh, mathematicians. They don't uh, think uh, anything about parallelization. They uh, should... Uh, <laughs> so we have to re-implement system from the scratch. Uh, we also uh, plan to port in a system to Intel Xeon Phi, uh, maybe to NVIDIA GPU to improve the speed up. And uh, we need to provide MPI version to use simulation on the large cluster. Uh, in case you are interested in head uh, modeling on a parallel computing system, uh, we uh, recently designed an HPC intention program. Uh, it's an English language program, uh, so you stu your students can attend it. Its uh, duration is two months, uh, two weeks of lectures, and here must be six six weeks of practice on supercomputers. And we have courses not only on general parallel computing technologies, but also interdisciplinary courses on head modeling and uh, parallel numerical methods. Thank you for your attention. Thank you very much. Any question, please? Please. So it's interesting that you are modeling the heart, and how it is compared with real activity of the heart. Is it possible to look how your model is fitting to the real, how hard is it working? Uh, it's uh, very hard to look how it's uh, really fit, but we can use some activities such as uh, dynamics of scroll waves. Yeah. We can uh, model dynamic of scroll waves and we can uh, see the dynamics of scroll waves uh, from such uh, medicine uh, procedures. Uh, actually, I'm not you sure. Are monitoring yes, results, yeah? yes. You are monitoring and then you can, can yes, you, we can compare results or we can do this by uh, results uh, by scroll or modeling because we can check uh, how the scroll waves. Uh, 
how it's go into the head or using simple scanners, but we cannot verify the uh, model, uh, the anatomical model of the head, uh, the fiber orientation, because we have to uh, rip the head from the chest. It's uh, not possible for it's the real. 3D model. Yes, it's 3D model. We have to open. Yes, we have to open chest. And they take a 3D screening. Yes. It actually the computing computational intensive depends on the model type uh, which we use. Uh, we use simple Aliyev Panfilov model. It's required on personal computer uh, roughly seven or eight hours. But uh, more complicated models such as uh, Ten Tuscar or Ekaterinburg Oxford model for the same task require three or five days on personal computers. Uh, it's uh, maybe, it's uh, not suitable for uh, usage in uh, hospital. We need to provide technology that uh, suitable for uh, general use in simple uh, operation. Uh, so uh, doctors in hospital can't wait uh, for three or five days uh, to uh, get some hints uh, how to heal this. It's clear. From, yes. from inside, what type of mathematics do you use? And how you want the questions? So what, what, what are uh, calculations? Calculations? So calculate, yeah. So long. It's uh, electrophysiological simulation. It's a partial differential equation. I can. What type, uh, what type of I can uh, actually. I'm specialist on parallel programming, not on <laughs> head modeling. I can uh, provide you with uh, information uh, for request for my colleagues. Thank you. More question, please. No. Uh, uh, just, I have a question. Yesterday we had a discussion about uh, that uh, Russian university won uh, cooperation with the external resource. Yes. Is it okay if you could pl please explain about this 15 year university? Oh, well, yeah. in Russia we have uh, programs which called uh, five uh, one thousands. It's aimed at uh, in 220 five Russian university must uh, be, uh, should be included in top uh, 100 university in uh, QS rating. And uh, now uh, 15 university is uh, part uh, of uh, this program and uh, our university also participating. Uh, so we interested in international collaboration. Uh, we need to attain uh, Conferences in Europe, uh, maybe in the US too, we need to write uh, articles together with uh, uh, faculties and researchers from uh, our universities, and we need uh, the uh, joint project. Uh, also, one of the, one of the projects is uh, internship for uh, foreign students. It's uh, also required for uh, not not all, uh, only internship, but uh, English language <coughs> educational program. Uh, internship program is uh, ready for use. Uh, now your students can attend it. Uh, we also <coughs> developing uh, master's program in HPC in English, but it's not ready yet. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.